I don't think that manganese is going to get disrupted out of the battery chemistries in the next 20 years, for example. 60% of the lithium ion batteries need manganese in them in varying amounts. And so it's a bit of a function of what does the battery manufacturer want to produce? Do they want to produce a high manganese content battery or lower manganese content battery? We may have talked before about MC batteries where they were pushing the nickel really high, like nine parts nickel to a half part manganese to a half part coal. Cobalt, and now they're coming back down again to what you might call mid-range, like a 622, call it 60 nickel, 20% manganese, 20% of cobalt. And then some battery manufacturers are, are looking at producing what they call high lithium manganese batteries. And those batteries are typically more along the lines of about 60, 65% manganese. So I don't think it's a threat at all, certainly not for the next, like I said, 20 years. And people are also doing research to see about creating a manganese anode because right now manganese is in the cathode portion of the battery. So they're looking at manganese for uh, lots of different applications. 